Welcome back to Afternoon Express. Now, when you think twins and fashion, your first picture is of children in coordinated wardrobes, which their moms picked out for them. I love twins like that. But actually, sisters Tahira and Zahira Ahmad have changed that association as they launched a designer label of singular flair and style, both on the show In the Loft right now. Ladies, welcome to Afternoon Express. Thank you. Thank you for having us. Here. When you were little girls as twins, did your mom used to dress you the same? Yeah, though? exactly yeah. the same. How cute. <laughs> oh my That's goodness, look at began. those cutie pies. <laughs> Oh, sweet man. But it looks like you guys have always been fashion forward. I mean, first of all, you ha you're not identical twins, but for no. our viewers at home, this is Tahira, and then that's Zahira. Ladies, you have been through it all together, from the womb to creating in your own womb. You guys <laughs> were <laughs> pregnant at the same time? Yes. That's incredible. Not planned, though. It wasn't planned. So now you've both got eight-month-old babies. Yeah, sure. and seven oh. months and one eight months. Wow. So sweet. <laughs> That's amazing how that happens when you don't plan it you and know. then you like... So what was that, how did you tell each other that you were pregnant at the same time? So seeing that we are twins, not identical though, we get some symptoms. So oh. I felt like nauseous all day and yeah. I, I took like three tests thinking it's me because <laughs> I really thought I was pregnant. Wow. And then I was like on the phone with her, I was like, no, it's not me. Like, I took three, it's not me. I'm going to buy you a test now, and I'm coming to you now. It's you. It's obviously you. It's one of <laughs> I mean, what were you feeling in that, t in that moment? She called me one morning to say, let's go somewhere. And I said, no, I'm feeling sick. I'm laying. She said, I'm bringing that pregnancy test to you right now. And then she was like, knocking on my door, come pee. <laughs> you need We're ready to take for you the to come. Test. <laughs> Yes, and then so she saw yeah. two lines, and then she was like, it is you, I told you, <laughs> yeah. it's you, you're oh, pregnant. Oh, cute. But now you've also got another baby together, your fashion business. Yes. yes. So how did that come about? Because okay. your mom's in it as well, hey? yes. yes. So my so, grandparents also. Oh, amazing. So it started from generations ago. My grandparents, my Grandmother was a dressmaker and my grandfather was a tailor. Then my mother kind of took over and she's a dressmaker doing it for a living. And now we also are doing it for a living. So we took over from that. How's it changed through the years and through the generations? Like how has the label and, uh, and the style, I suppose, so of my, the family business changed? My grandma, so she only created like for elderly women and then when my mom started with us, like the outfits that you just showed, mm. so she made everything. So she'd started making like kids' clothing and our neighbors would see us running down the street, parading in our new clothing, and then they'd wanted the same thing for yeah. their children. Yeah. Um, so that's how it started basically. And then when we reached like 15 and Matrik, we actually started the brand Twin Image Clothing. Amazing. Yeah, so it's basically now just from the age of 15 to like 35, and wow. older, actually, also. And to tell you something, do you know how lucky that you are, that you had a gran and a mom to yeah. make you all of your dresses? Yes. Like, my gran sews so well, she would always, like, make us little things. And I remember when I was, like, in grade two, I needed a little dress to go to the school disco. Oh, yeah. And I had nothing to wear. You can imagine, I probably had a wardrobe full of clothes. But I was like, yeah, I have nothing to wear, mom. <laughs> And my mom took a pillowcase, and the theme was 60s. Nice. And my mom took a pillowcase, and she sewed me one of those 1960s oh, yeah. little dresses. She gave me earrings, and she was like, there you go, go party. And I was like, mm. You've got to <laughs> have <a new> <laughs> I love that. I love that. I mean, that speaks to your style. It speaks totally. to your creativity. And you ladies have done that with your twin fashion wear. Yeah. I already see some huge differences in your yeah. style. Mm -hmm. I totally mean, different. Speak <laughs> us through the personalities and how that's translated in your fashion. So I think I'm more like the more is more type. Yeah. More is more. Is less is more. <laughs> no, I'm with yeah, you. We more is different. more. Yeah, but I suppose it works well when you're creating yeah. together or do you sometimes bicker with each other because you've we got do. different creativity Yeah, we vibes. definitely do. But um, we tend to work when we put our designs together and you yes. can see later on. Lovely. Surprising, and it always works. Always works. Beautiful. Well, let's have a look. Let's yeah. see what you brought us. I mean, these dresses are so to die for. You ladies have brought fashion, but you've made it chic, you've made it so elegant and you've made it evening wear. Yeah. So basically this outfit, like, you can wear it to a glamorous evening. Don't wear it to a wedding, carpet. the bride will yeah, freak out. <laughs>
This is gorgeous, though. Yeah. But you haven't always started with formal metric dancewear. You no. guys also started yeah. with casual. Yes, yes. It, started it started there. It started like casual wear. In high school, we used to put clothing in our bags and <laughs> sell it at school. <laughs> you used to sell clothes at school? Yeah. Yes. I hope the principal... Because we make us something and then wear it wherever and our friends at high school will see it. And they'll message us, please make me that and bring it to school on Monday. Um, I'll buy it. And slowly we like started a little business in school. Oh, and I love that. that. And were well, you company. learning the proper like business? Like, did you know how to keep a, a log of what you had sold? And what did you do with the money that you had made? Did you save it? Yeah, not really, eh? Yeah. <laughs> I school, like, we'll go out every weekend and not ask our parents for money then and use our own money. Oh, brilliant. Wow. These looks are so beautiful. I mean, glamour to its core. You've brought all the sparkles out in both looks, that we, the one we just saw and this one that's on right now. Here what fabrics do you guys love playing with? What textures do you love to play with? Oh, eh? Hey, because all our clients is different. Mm. So we basically, they'll brief us and we'll give them what they want. Mm. Yeah, and make them feel beautiful and... And I see that you have not shied away from celebrating the femininity, femininity yeah. and the female form. Of course, we've got our lady showing some leg, but we've got something here that's a little bit more yeah. modest, a little bit more yes. conservative. Beautiful. This is stunning. What was the inspiration behind this look? So that we'll use that more for bridal. Okay. Yeah, we can play around with the fabrics though. And I know a lot of brides don't really go for white anymore. Yeah, so, yeah. that's perfect also <laughs> for bridal wear. I absolutely love this dress. It is so beautiful. I think that you can put anyone in any of your garments and they will look yeah. like an Oscar <laughs> award-winning statue. But you know, the one that we've just seen, it's, got, it's so romantic. Mm. Like, yeah. it reminds me of something from that old era, yes, you know? Like it's it. really, really beautiful. Yeah. I mean, as we're speaking about Oscar statues, this lady looks super beautiful, so slimming, so tall. I mean, a lot of ladies kind of shy away from a lot of sequins because it can yes. accentuate yeah, the thinking. parts you want to hide. But I see here, we went for it anyway. I love that. Yeah. We're fearless and we're bold with our fashion. What styles would you recommend women wear this season? Like, what is, have you, have you, I mean, are you guys quite trendy? Do you have seasonal looks? Mm. We try to, yes. Um, so we have our day-to-day -day clients oh, as well. So this we is my number out one. Out the year. That is sensational. This is beautiful. I love the mallet, the short in the front yeah. and long at the back because, you know, you can wear your most killer heels <laughs> exactly. and people Show will more. see them. <laughs> Let me tell you, if I didn't have grandmamas, I would be in that dress every weekend. No, honey, listen, this is what we do with double-sided tape. Yeah. Double-sided tape there is, is not your best enough friend. to make it in work. the world. I need scaffolding. <laughs> <laughs> Plus our <I'm> Paris. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is beautiful. She looks super elegant. I love the fact that we are just being confident here. Yes. I like that. Okay. Another wow, showstopper, hey? Oh, no, that is just magnificent. Okay, I, w I could totally wear that. Absolutely. Ladies, I think from now on I am sourcing you to dress me for every Please. event, for every wedding, <laughs> every <No>. family function. <laughs> Maybe even just to go to spa to get um, some bread. <laughs> I'll definitely just be like waltzing in my woolly's head to toe, honey. Looking dope. <laughs> Let's have a look at the I think this is the final one that we have. Yes. Also lovely. And just showing that your collections can dress any age, yeah. any look, oh, that is very beautiful. Any body shape, that is so romantic. That whimsical feel, that fairy tale that this breast brings across is so beautiful. And I can see our model is feeling ever so How many confident. collections do you have a year? About four. Okay, yeah. amazing. Seasonal. So you just keep yes. on turning yes. through the seasonal And then looks. for Eid, so. Okay. okay. And the collection, I have to say my favorite has to be look number two. I love that color. Thank you ladies so much for bringing such fashion to Afternoon Express. Thank, Thank, <laughs> Thank you so much for being here and sharing all these fantastic dresses. Yeah, Thank you dresses. for having us. Now coming up, Benchmark brings it in person with their latest release, Tango.